Yeah, there they are. Hey guys. I'm gonna freeze to death. 50 degrees out here. Oh, what do you guys see? The tower lights are right there. But the one above it is the UFO, I think. Second time I've seen it this week. That is the other light. Tower light. Ah, uh, street light. <laughs> I have lights on my mind. Whoa. Yeah, I wonder if it's gonna move now. <sighs> so cold out here. And I only have a sweatshirt on, so I won't be out here long. But, I just wanted to show you guys. That's the same spot where I saw it. Whoa! What was that? That was a bright, bright light. I hope you guys saw that. It might have been an orb. It hurt my eyes. <laughs> oh! That was freaking bright. Oh! Yeah, there it is again. Oh my goodness. Is there? Uh, my theory is they like the energy from the towers. What is the freak is that light? Then break the light right there. Whoa. The light is getting closer. This is one of our backyards. Oh, it's freezing. Freaking my ass off for you guys. Oh. Yeah, what if there's a UFO gonna move? It looks like there's two of them there, but it could be this one there. I thought I'd do this live since I'm gonna share my UFO experiences on Paranormal Key Radio. Oh, what was that? That might have been a buzz. <laughs> it's still kinda stationary, but you might see Hazen, but you might see it just above a regular street light. And that's the towers. I meant to say our tower. That's our back hills back there. This is where I've been seeing the UFOs. Or so called UFOs. You guys be the judge, alright? Try to keep as open minded as possible so I won't be in trouble by the uh, <laughs> men in black, right? <laughs> I'm surprised the men in black hasn't really been knocking up my door every time I film these. <laughs> I know they're out there, I know there's a real group minimal that, so that's why I'm being careful about my titles and everything. Whoa! What was that? It's like you're shooting other this out. What the heck? Did you see that? I tell you, I filmed the craziest <sighs> things out here. Whoa, did you see that bright light? What was that? That's like the third time I've seen that bright light that blinking. <laughs> I'm getting nervous now. <clears throat> oh my lord. I come in peace, spirits, there are the spirits. I've been recording, uh, supposedly, <laughs> UFOs. See, it moved, it moved, it moved. It was way up there and then it moved. Oh. It finally moved. It's way up there and top earlier and now it's moved. I'm gonna try to put more videos on TikTok as well. 
Hit that, what are you gonna call it? <laughs> oh my god, I freaking my ass off. <sighs> but at least I'm wearing a heavy shirt, a sweatshirt. <laughs> oh, there goes another one. That's why you see me rocking. This is so cold. Chili! You see, actually, I said that shit always freaks me out. I don't know why. <laughs> I never liked that shit. <clears throat> I don't know why. Freaking cold. I wonder how long it's gonna stay. Always at exactly at 9 o'clock. That is when they come out. It's not, it's like about 9.30 here now. Oh, 9.41. But that's when I know that that's when they come out. Exactly at 9. Out here in California. I'm out here in Hemet. And I did my first report, a uh, UFO report last night. I'm gonna have to do another one. <laughs> so yeah, be sure to tune in to our Paranormal Key Radio. This week, I'm going to share my crazy UFO encounters. Oh my goodness, almost one there. Indianapolis, wow. You're a night owl like me. It is still there, I'm just floored by it. Whoa, there's another bright old. Thank you, spirits. I don't care what people say in their bias about old I believe in orbs because I had crazy encounters with orbs. <clears throat> I'll stay out here about another minute or so. And I'm freaking my ass off. And yes, I'm saying that again. <laughs> it's moving down. It's moving down a bit. It just moved down a bit. Hey, y'all, if you're watching, hey, hey. Let me shine this helmet. This is one of our backyards. We got like three. <laughs> oh. Yep, yeah, three. Woo. We're in the country area. So, there will be hardly no uh, car lights or nothing like that. And we're out in the country. So, we even got a farm across the way, so. Oh, hey, my hands is frozen. I just heard a noise. It literally moved. So I don't think it's a drone or anything like that. What do you guys think? It's another UFO? Huh? It's so weird how I see them when I'm going to talk about them this week. That's freaking weird. So make sure you guys tune in to my Wednesday show. I have a solo show and I'm going to talk about my crazy UFO encounters. Like tonight, <laughs> for example. Ever since we moved out here, I noticed more and more sightings of UFOs. I think they were way out in the country. <clears throat> Is freezing. What the hell? Did you guys see it right over there? Whoa. I can almost see my breath. That's how cold it is. Whoa, what was that? Did you guys see that one? That was a huge bright one there. Whoa. <laughs> I'm gonna have to rewatch this. This is pretty cool. So thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna end it now because I'm freezing. And I'll be right now. I'll see you guys on Wednesday evening. Here at the Wednesday Radio. 7 to 8 p.m. Pacific Time and 10 Eastern. We're all sharing my crazy UFO encounters. <laughs> Alright, night all.